What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, I'll be skinning. It's your boy, Seiko, nigga. And today, we are here to check out Mortal Kombat 11, the official story reveal. Is at the Mortal Kombat 11 reveal event. I'm pretty mad that we didn't get the invite to the motherfucking reveal event, you know yeah, what I'm crazy. saying? Yeah, it's crazy. We, we really wanted to come, you know what I'm saying, but nobody, nobody is. They're like, oh, they're just going to come in there and smell like we. I, I guess that's how they were feeling. It's crazy. It's okay. Like, nobody hit us up. It's like, hey, man, you're, you're welcome. To we didn't get anything. But, like we said in the other videos, you know what I'm saying, Mortal Kombat, that's our shit. Even to this day, we still playing still damn. Still play, play this shit party today. Yeah, yeah, for real, later on, probably after this day. You know what I'm saying? We Shut still playing Mortal Kombat, <laughs> nigga, like, on that shit. So, this one coming out, I'm pretty sure in like two, a month or two. So, I'm going to say something. My nigga, I seen, like, I don't know, I want to go on my Twitter. But at the same time, we're going to see what the same shit I seen. Nigga. The fatalities on this motherfucker. See, see, I, I, ain't, and, I ain't seen and that. The LT, R, the R2, R, L2. You know how you press that shit, to, how we win usually? The, the X-ray, Jay? Yeah, no, nah, the L2, R2 button. The what? back two buttons on the control. Yeah, that's the X-ray. Where you, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nigga, them shits is lethal as fuck, my nigga. Like, they long as hell lethal. Bro, <laughs> this shit go crazy. See... And we're going to check out, we're going to do a different video later on about like the, the character reveals and shit. They said there's a video out about like the new person, the boss or whatever. So Yeah, so I seen a new nigga too. Yeah, the so. The nigga look kind of crazy, for where, bro. If that's the nigga I think it is. We're going to have to do a video to that. But we about to just get into this with the official story. We witnessed combos, fatalities, but one of the hallmarks of Mortal Kombat has always been the rich detailed story. So what can we look forward to in Mortal Kombat 11 when it comes to the story? Yeah, you, you saw a glimpse of the beginning of the story here. We actually have a video here. It's the entire opening cinematic, the whole prologue of the story. It really picks up right after MK9, and I think you guys are going to get a big kick out of it. Here you go, man. right now i'm pretty sure that's the basis of this game is that like all the good has turned evil and that's and why the evil like, turn has to be good i don't know maybe they even eviler damn so ain't no damn good at all it's, it's more combat evil. it's more combat they, they, they took all the damn shit and fuck we just gonna make it all back <laughs> yeah i think so But you wear my amulet. Finally, you embrace the truth the elder gods deny. The truth. He, he said he's wearing his amulet. So now that means he turned into that other shit. Yeah. 
And he's saying that the elder guys, you know what I'm saying, that they don't, they're not telling you the truth, I guess. So there's some deeper, dark, deep shit that you don't know about. This shit like a movie. Yeah, this shit going crazy. Truth I was cast out for speaking. The truth I embrace, Shinnok, is that mercy is wasted on those who defile Earthrealm. I will destroy our enemies before they destroy us. Starting with you. She's one of the gods. But know this. The arc of the universe bends to my will. Oh, it is only a matter of time. She got me. I was going to do that in another video, but fuck you know what, we about to check it out. Let me see what they say right here. Ed, that was amazing. April 23rd cannot come soon enough. Okay. So the story picks off right after MKX. Dark rain rains. Time Dark is being rain. manipulated. How fun was it to dive into the rich Mortal Kombat lore and design moments when these legendary characters confront a different version of themselves? Yeah, that was the most fun about, you know, how we created the story. Um, we basically introduce a character, Kronika, who has been kind of running the show since the first Mortal Kombat. Everything that was happening was to her plan, up to the point where Raiden kind of screwed things up. And that's when she's kind of stepping in, and she's just going to play tricks with time that's going to introduce really situations that's where that's old that's characters that's meeting their younger selves and it's 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 such a great um great story mode we could not be more proud of this ed boone thank you so much for being here give it up for the legend ladies and gentlemen i'm about to check out this motherfucking gameplay this is what i came here for <laughs> Please welcome to the stage, creative director of NetherRealm Studios and the co-creator of Mortal Kombat, Ed Boon! Netherrealm Studios have done it again. There is so much to unpack here, and I'm sure you can't wait to dive into some of the gameplay. Yeah, you know, you, we've been biting our tongues since, you know, six months ago around E3, dying to, dying to show you guys this game. But we really wanted to kind of build the suspense. This is absolutely going to pay off for that. All right, Ed, I'll let you do the honors. Take it away. Yeah, you guys, first, I think the first thing you wanted to do is see the actual game. So just let's, let's just roll them here. So, we're 
we're very excited to show you. First look at Mortal Kombat 11. Nobody else has seen this. Today we have seven characters to show you. Some returning, some new. There's far more in this game that we'll be able to show you right here. But we do want to hit on the enhancements from the game, the fighting, and the custom character variations. Garrus is a new fighter in the game and who can, has a yeah, really cool time right control now. abilities. You know, Mortal, yeah, in yeah. NetherRealm games, we really try to add something new. Mortal Kombat X, we introduced a feature called Character Variations. Three versions of every single character. MK11 is expanding on that idea, creating custom character variations. He had the red in his hood. MK11 is expanding on that idea. MK11 You got that, that, that red outline with that shit. Yeah. Three versions. It was already evil. Oh, he was. He was good. What was of every single character. MK11 is expensive. Who was more trying to save niggas? I feel like Sub Zero was more the good one. Alright, yeah, so the Scorpion tried to kill everybody. Essentially. Alright. Standing on that idea, creating custom character variations, the player can actually create die themselves. So you notice they're going to be selecting different versions of scorpions. Some were created by the players, some were created already in the game. Same thing with Baraka. Games, you expect the fighting to be brutal. MK11 sees the return of Baraka, who was a fan oh, favorite from shit. Mortal Kombat 2. So let's see I some of the moves he does here. This shit's real. Oh, that blood is flying at the beginning. It looks like the whole world is a bitch. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Not to be outdone. Scorpion has a few tricks up the sleeve. Okay, now without getting too technical, we're going to get into some of the geeky fighting game uh, moments up there. Mortal Kombat, traditionally we've had one meter that's a shared resource amongst yeah, the say, offense, the defense, meter. and the super moves. Mortal Kombat X is separating all three of those. So we have a horizontal meter is the offense attacks, vertical meter is the defensive attacks. See, Baraka's going to shooting two using his offensive moves. Also can extend this leg stab here into a throw with a... Also, Scorpion here is going to escape a, from a knockdown using his defensive meter. And you're going to notice here that the uh, fatal blow is... That's actually tied to 30% of the of the health meter when it's reduced you get fatal blow available this adds completely new dynamic and tension to the fighting that's both of baraka and scorpion have a fatal blow right now baraka wins this fight round two fight oh my goodness so Scorpion missed his fatal blow attack, but it actually will regenerate after a cooldown period. I gotta see that one again. Damn. This shit going. Actually, will regenerate after a cooldown period. Elbow. I thought it was. So you notice his, his fatal blow is established. He can pull it off. And now to be outdone, Baraka now has his fatal blow available. Oh, oh, oh. That's the shit I see right here. This is oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, and of course, it wouldn't be Mortal Kombat without fatality. Damn, we need that 
shit to come out now. Nigga. Me that. Now. Like, now, nigga. We gotta have that now. Yo. Mortal Kombat, hook us up with the leak or something. Y'all leak us up with this. Yo, come on, yo, man. Something. We need this something, my nigga. <laughs> that shit going crazy. Mortal Kombat motherfucking 11. We'll have a whole series of us just playing with each character. For real. Like, nigga, they post a video of it. Oh, Instagram. Nigga, all, that. Fuck, nigga. all that. All that. We really going crazy with this Mortal Kombat shit, nigga. Yo, this shit. I really can't wait for this. Nigga, like, like, I've never been so excited for a video Yeah, game. that's what I'm saying. There's been certain games. I wasn't even just excited for 2K. I was a little excited for 2K, but Mortal Kombat? We well, got all them characters. The story. The different fatality. The little X-ray shit. It's too. more realer, and it's just like the old version with the blood pouring out every hit. I and like that you shit. Ain't gotta Spend six minutes on a game or six minutes for a quarter, and you getting straight to the action. You get straight to the action. You go have fun. Shit up. You get to run it back quick. Yeah, you can play with your niggas or you can play the story mode. Like, Either way, play a tower, play online. For real, you gonna have a great time with Mortal Kombat. You wanna know something? I think Mortal Kombat should introduce stuff. We do. I think Mortal Kombat, they already introduced online, but I feel like Mortal Kombat should have more like a. A uh, more expanded map play. Like they should add a map play into the game. Like you go ahead, and you can go around and fight like more multiple people, and then f form like a group or something, and then like travel in that group. Just like basically take the park scheme of 2K or something like that. So you're saying more like a, I don't know if you know RPG game is like how you're like going around instead of just like one screen. How you can click arcade and do something like how you really create up your more common person. Go here to do this. No, go here to do that's that. That's the idea. But what I want to do is like something like Fortnite mixed with Sims. Basically, you can fight out there, but you can also build your own thing. Now, not houses and shit, because Mortal Kombat didn't come with houses. You build stuff that comes with Mortal Kombat. And then you form your family. Like, basically, not like that. You form you like, a, like other fighters and shit like that. And they be in a group. Like, you can, I, I can have an account. You have an account. We go ahead, build some shit together. We so, play like, together. boom. Like, we get a house together. Or something like build like a little whatever they call them shits out there back in the time, and then we fight niggas out there, or we go ahead and go find resources and shit. So as far as the actual fight style, would you be saying like us say like me and you two is the family, and we like damn, let's go look for some two on twos or something like that. We would fight like that. There's two on twos on this game, like the old one. So we basically switch swap. Like if you you want to switch with me, you call me in. I go in the game, boom. Just like how the gameplay is, it's just gonna be a two on two. That would be hot, but I also feel like if they really had something to where, like, it's not just straight up that, if they had, like, something where it could be four people fighting at one time, everyone just really brawling out doing some crazy shit. Yeah, that'd be but like, But, like, it would kind of take away as much crazy shit that they could do, probably, but if they was to do something like this, it could expand that, like, to more, like, it could, that, but I feel like they'd have to change the map play, like, the map couldn't be, be straight on like that. The map would have to surround. Like, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, like, that's what I'm saying. That that would have to come with the other map play with the expanded online, I feel like, where everybody just, you feel me, just can go meet up with each other and then go play 4 on 4, play 5 on 5, and that's it. You can't go past 5 on 5. There's going to be too much happiness. You can't, you can't be doing all that. Fuck all that. Damn, we just thought of a new gameplay for you on combat shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I feel like y'all should try to do something like that, but at the same time, Y'all already yeah, doing yeah, that. Yeah, y'all doing y'all thing. We just taking it. Yeah. Just taking out the box. Yeah, facts, facts. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, shout out to motherfucking Mortal Kombat. Shout out to that nigga Ed Boom, man. The motherfucking GOAT. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, all that. Till next time, YouTube. We out, nigga.